Hello, Fear the Meerkat here, welcome to another episode of Let's Pray, the world's not enough for the Nintendo 64. Now I have uh, tried this a couple of times and tried uh, recording this episode a couple of times and eventually decided that I was going to wait a while before um, trying again because this is difficult. Um, but I intend to finish this in uh, this uh, this episode. Finish uh, City of Walkways 2. So let's go with this. Yes, those uh, helicopters do look dangerous, as dangerous. Basically, they are as dangerous as they look, I think, is what I meant. So. Okay. Okay, this stuff is going to be helpful. This is here because that happens. And the only way to not get killed by that thing is to stay in there for a bit. Don't worry, they won't come in here. But there are people. So apparently it's okay for these uh, these people to die. They are um, Zukovsky's uh, Zukovsky's men. It's okay for them to die as long as I'm not the one who kills them. So we're uh, save points part way through the, uh, the level, but there are so. Okay, there are a lot of these guys in this particular place. At least I have some idea of what's coming up next. Now, unfortunately, there are people trying to destroy you here and kill you. Now, uh, this part is okay to fall down as long as you fall down in the correct uh, place. But it is it, it is quite hard to do this bit. Well, 
It would be quite hard to do if it wasn't okay for you to fall down there. I should say. It is okay for you to fall down there, so. Oh, sugar. Oh, I, I thought I was doing quite well, too. Uh, see you in a minute. Ah, here we go. Okay, that thing's the first proper boss, in my opinion, and... But yeah, we haven't heard, seen the uh, last of him, unfortunately. Remember whether there's anyone who tries to kill me here. Probably there is. We start to um, drown in the, uh, the caviar. Possible you do. See how this is why um, it needs a, a quick save or something like that at some point during this episode because this has been going on for what feels like quite a while anyway, and it's really annoying to have to go for all of this again. Uh, anyway, I've gotten further than this before, so... That's probably how James Bond would have done that. Ah, 
Ow! Okay, and that's how idiots uh, do that to themselves. won't work because that happened. I think there's a way to do this but I'm gonna have to be pretty uh, quick here and pretty lucky. Or there could be other ways to do this that I haven't thought of. That's entirely possible. But you can see my car down there. I think if I aim for getting to that manage to do it on time. Maybe. Uh -huh. Right. was that nerve-wracking. <laughs> I have to say, that was quite difficult. Um, uh, that was quite, quite difficult. But, people are going to be shooting at me now, evidently. Well, we'd have to redo that. Or not. Probably not, actually. Well, that was a hard level. He's swimming in caviar, by the way. Russian machinery for Elector King. She's paying me one million dollars for a special job. My nephew Nikolai is smuggling some equipment to Istanbul for her. Elektra has tried to kill me already, so Nikolai may be in danger. This is my business now too, Mr. Bond. She seemed... Uh, sorry, I shouldn't be calling Zukowski she. Um, he seemed very calm for someone who's about to drown in caviar. <laughs> I mean, it would be an interesting way to die. Um, it's probably a world record for 
most unusual way to die. Probably another tricky one this, but I'm going to try it anyway. Uh, Turncoat is one of those levels that uh, we also have in the PlayStation 1 version. As is the two walkways, although uh, it's definitely changed with some levels. City of Walkways was uh, completely different uh, in the PlayStation 1 version. Now we need to pursue Bullion, a character who has not been introduced by this point in this game, which must be a bit confusing if you haven't seen the film. And if you haven't seen the film, watch it. It's pretty good. This used to be a KGB safe house. We're trying to use the surveillance equipment to contact Nikolai's submarine. Submarine? What class of submarine? You call it a uh, Victor III. Nuclear. That's what Renard wants. The sub itself. If they put the warhead in the sub's reactor, they'll get an instant catastrophic meltdown. But why? The explosion will destroy Istanbul and contaminate the Bosphorus for decades. There'll be only one way to get oil out of the Caspian Sea, Electra's pipeline. I've got something on the emergency frequency. Two six-digit numbers, cycled every 15 seconds. That's a GPS signal. It must be M, using the locator card from the bomb. The signal is coming from here. Maiden's Tower. Bomb! I've got to stop Bullion warning Renard. Whoever Bullion is. I'm assuming that's the person who just uh, ran away. Hello, Seven. Zukovsky's driver Bullion planted the bomb. Don't let him get away. I've got a feeling that I can actually let him get away and it well. Bond, why did you not take any weapons with you for this one? I'm. You, keep, you seem to just forget that you have uh, that you have perfectly good weapons. I personally don't think that you need to do this in a certain amount of time or something like that. But oh, for heck, I. Okay, it's a rather silly looking gun, but it gets the job done surprisingly uh, well, actually. Hi, have any of you seen the Bulletproof Fest anywhere? Uh oh. Sometimes these turn out to be. Yeah, you know, I was hoping that was that was moon, as it were. I figure but bulletproof fast in it. A bulletproof fast. A smaller target if I stay down here, like, like it. How dare you? She's half dressed, you jerk. Not that I don't think Bond would understand the appeal, but still.
because it probably looks kind of boring to you for me to be going more slowly, but it does make sense. Hello, I'm here. Did you not see me? have much to say here. Um, no, I really don't. supposed to jump there. You know what? I've been doing this for quite some time. I feel like I could use a break. I will see you next time.